Welcome back to Lightning Problem Solving, where we keep you up to date on cutting edge manufacturing and problem solving techniques. Today I'm going to be addressing a question I get asked all the time, and that's, Tom, when is it time to hire a manufacturing consultant? By the time a company is asking me this question, normally the answer is about two years ago. At the end of this video, I'm going to give you a checklist to evaluate whether or not it's the right time for you to hire a manufacturing consultant. As a consultant, when I walk into a company in just three short days, I'm able to come up with something that can help the company more than enough to pay for any consulting fees. Whether a company is already profitable and just looking for a way to prosper even more, or whether a company is struggling to make any profit at all. Three short days is all it should take for a consultant to size up the situation and point you in the right direction. Sometimes it takes longer than this to provide the oversight necessary to train employees to follow a new system. But by the time a company's culture successfully shifts enough to maintain new standards, hiring a good consultant always more than pays for itself in the long run. I've noticed that people get tunnel vision when they've worked at a company longer than nine months. If I stayed at a company longer than nine months, even I would need to renew my thinking so I wouldn't fall into the culture of that company. Every time I go to a company, I see extremely talented people that know a lot of the answers. But maybe they think that this is not their job. Or they throw up their hands and say, it just won't happen here at this company. And when their company finally decides to hire a consultant, those are the types of people that are the first to say, finally this company has decided to do something. Another thing I see all the time is the 80-20 rule, where 80% of the useful work is done by 20% of the people. So I don't get stuck on titles. Whether they're quality, operations, manufacturing, or training, they just need someone to be driving the lean environment. And that's where a consultant comes in. So here's the checklist I promised you. Are you ready to evaluate whether it's time for your company to hire a manufacturing consultant? If your manufacturing facility can relate to any of these list items, then hiring a good consultant will more than pay for itself. Anytime you have a problem that's not getting solved, anytime you're not meeting your targets, if you have any scrap at all, it will help you to look for a better way to manage your scrap costs. If your warranty is too high, or maybe some of your staff seem to be untrainable, like maybe you have an old dog that needs to be taught new tricks, or a young smarty pants that thinks that he or she knows everything. If your managers are not driving the results required, your company doesn't have a lean culture and needs Needs cultural transformation. Your employees are all doing different things and not following the standardized work. If you have a process that frequently needs the magic touch of your best employees, then you need a consultant. Because what that really means is most of your employees are improperly trained. If you need a schedule that perfectly fits your facility, a schedule that perfectly implements lean manufacturing so you're able to maximize your profits and save the most money. You need help implementing a world-class training matrix that drives perfection with minimal manager's work. If you need help running Kaizen events or DOEs. And finally, if you want to learn how to set the right targets. A common thing that companies tell me is they just don't know the right targets to set. Or they don't know what a world-class scrap rate would be for their industry. Or how much they should be spending on warranty per month. Or maybe they're making great money, but they're also leaving money on the table. And finally, I'm going to add a bonus item to the list. Do you have suppliers that fail quality inspections or can't keep their schedule? Or can't make a run at rate? Require them to hire a consultant if they don't meet the requirements within two weeks. If you've gone through this evaluation and you've decided it is time to hire a consultant, feel free to contact me. And if I'm not the right guy for your job, I have lots of connections. I'll put you in touch with someone who is. I've never been surprised at a problem. I've seen every type of problem out there. Every problem is solvable. Sometimes companies just need a different way to look at their issues. And a fresh set of trained eyes is often all it takes to make that difference. Why let an untrained engineer that's engulfed in your company's culture work a lean manufacturing problem that someone like myself could solve in just three days. Also, I love to hear from you guys. Let me know in the comments below, what do you think makes a good consultant? Also, if your consultant had superpowers, what would those powers be and how would they help your company? If this video has helped you, be sure to click like and click the lightning logo over here to subscribe to my channel so you won't miss out on any lightning problem solving tips. Thanks for watching and have a great day.